These things look complicated, right? Well, let me tell you a secret. They are not. They are your friends. And I'll tell you why. With these guys, you can solve any motion problem with constant acceleration. For example, I'm holding this ball one meter above the ground and I drop it. How long did it take for the ball to reach the ground? S is displacement, U initial velocity, V final velocity, A acceleration and T time. First step, choose a positive direction. For our situation, we'll choose a positive direction downwards. Step two, fill in the S, U, V, A, T data. S will be one meter, U will be zero because at the moment I release the object, it hasn't accelerated yet. V the final velocity, I don't know. And I don't care. A will be the acceleration. Acceleration due to gravity. And finally, T is a time is what I'm looking for. In step three, I will choose the equation that doesn't have the variable I don't care about. S equals ut plus one half at squared. Step four, super simple. Just rearrange the equation you selected to put the variable you're looking for as subject and then plug in the numbers. In our situation, we find that the ball will fall in 0.45 seconds. This technique works all the time when the acceleration is constant. Explaining physics ideas in just one minute is pretty challenging. So support me, comment, like, and follow.